Hey guys, what is up? And today I'm coming at you with another Destiny video and I want to talk about the dawning because we just got some information on that uh, yesterday, day before yesterday. I don't know, somewhere around there I've been like, I don't know, I'm just really sleep deprived and I feel like shit. But anyways, we got three new exotics, com well technically two new exotics coming. One of them has been in the game before in year one, so I've never used it because I didn't get in Destiny until year two, and that is Icebreaker. Um, also, we are finally getting the two other variants of the Thunder Lord, which is the Solar Lord and the uh, Void Lord, which... The official names are the Abaddon and the Nova something. I don't exactly remember. God, I'm terrible at this. But anyways, um, also, um, Sparrow Racing League is coming back. Although it will, for some reason, not be permanently part of the game. They're putting in it for the dawning, which starts December 13th and ends January 2nd. Second or third, I believe. Somewhere around there. I'm not exactly sure. God, I'm so terrible at this. But anyways, yeah, for some reason, they're not going to make it a permanent part of the game. But apparently, though, even after the dawning is over, you can still play Sparrow Racing League in a private match, which is weird to me. I mean, I don't understand why they won't let it just stay in the game as its own multiplayer playlist i don't know it could be that you know since you can get gear from sparrow racing league um they don't want people to rank up in the game too quick um i don't know i'm not too sure about that but also they are adding a very cool feature in my opinion which is strike scoring um which basically you go to savala he'll give you bounties and you like do certain things it's kind of like challenge of the elders where you have to get a certain amount of points and you'll complete those bounties and I believe completing those bounties has a chance of dropping the new, or well, the new two exotics and then the new icebreaker um, exotic sniper rifle. So, yeah, um, all in all, the dawning is actually more content than what I expected it to be. Or, you know, whatever their Christmas holiday thing, well, live event that they were going to do. It is a little bit more content than I did expect, but still not enough, especially with them only having Sparrow Racing League available during this event. I, I, just, I don't understand what the fuck is up with that, but yeah, um, I, I don't know. Hopefully we get some kind of minor content update in between now and, you know, Destiny 2 or, you know, maybe some kind of little expansion. I don't know. We're going to need something because these live events are just, I'm serious, they're just not going to cut it, and people are going to get bored and shit, and they're going to start leaving the game, but, um, yeah, guys, anyways, that's all I wanted to talk about, so if you guys enjoy the video, then please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys later. Bye.